Andy. Yes. Uh, yes. Hello. One of the one of the challenges we had a while ago was for you to read. Oh, hello. Uh, <laughs> was for you to read a, uh, the world's first formal customer complaint. Yes, I have that right here. Excellent. I think once you're once you're set back up, this would be an excellent thing to do. Excellent. And, and then people who haven't heard it will now know that uh that guy's a that guy's a jerk <laughs> <laughs> okay <clears throat> so uh yes for those for those just tuning in this is um a complaint tablet to uh uh ian nasir and i'm probably i will pr i promise to mispronounce all of the nouns um there's a clay tablet from ancient Babylon written in 1750 BC. It's a complaint to a merchant named uh, Ian Nasir from a customer named Nani written in Akkadian cuneiform. It is considered to be the oldest known written complaint. It is currently kept in the British Museum. And this is what Nani got someone else to write, I imagine. And I imagine him dictating it. I don't think he'd be doing it himself. And he says, Tell Ian Nasir, Nanny sends the following message. When you came, you said to me as follows, I will give Gimel Sin when he comes. Fine quality copper ingots. You left then, but you did not do what you promised me. You put ingots, which were not good, before my messenger uh, slits in and said, if you want to take them, take them. If you do not want to take them, go away. What do you take me for? That you treat someone like me with such contempt. I have sent as messengers, gentlemen like ourselves, to collect the bag with the money deposited with you, but you have treated me with contempt by sending them back to me empty-handed territory. Is there anyone among the merchants who trade with Telman who has treated me in this way? You alone treat my messenger with contempt on account of that one trifling mina of silver which I owe you. You feel free to speak in such a way while I have given to the palace on your behalf a thousand and eighty pounds of copper and Sumi Abum has likewise given a thousand and eighty pounds of copper a part temple of Samas. How have you treated me that for the and then he, he, he it shows here in the cuneiform that he passes out and then comes to <laughs> again and he says how have you treated me for that copper. You have withheld my money bag from me in enemy territory. It is now up to you to restore my money to me in full. Take cognizance. That is not of fine quality. I shall from now on select and take the ingots individually in my own yard, and I shall exercise against you my right of rejection. Winky face, send. <laughs> Well, there you go. I'm so mad. <laughs> I think this kind, uh, this kind of language is uh, probably written in uh, care uniform. Uh, nah. 